Good afternoon, everyone. Today, we embark on a journey to demystify the intricacies of past year exam questions for October 2021 for A level students. Examining the past offers us a compass to navigate the challenges of it, empowering us with insight and strategy to conquer the present. Let's delve into the treasure trove of past exams, unlocking the key to success and mastering the art of academic excellence. Question one. A student observes the cell using a light microscope. The student then draws the cells. Which items will the student need to calculate the magnifications of the drawing? To calculate the magnification of the drawing, the student needs eyepiece reticle to measure the cells under the microscope. And on top of that, the students also need ruler and also stitched micrometer scale is used to calibrate the IP's gratitude. So the correct answer for question number one is one, two, and four. Which equation correctly show the relationship between magnification, image size, and actual size in microscopy? The formula for magnification is image size divided by actual size. And when you want to get the actual size, the formula is image size divided by magnifications. So the answer for number two is one and three. In which cell structures does the DNA transcription focus? Each of these organelles for a plus mitochondrion nucleus contain its own DNA and machinery for transcription. And the closest answer to these questions is B. Which row could correctly identify the nucleic acid present in two different virus particles in a sample of air? To identify the nucleic acid present in two different virus particles, it is essential to know that a virus can either have DNA or RNA as its generic material, but not both simultaneously. Therefore, the correct rule would show one virus with DNA and the other with RNA is 3 and 4. Test on four samples for a mixture of biological molecules give the result shown in the table. Which biological molecule were in the texture? The answer for this will be non-reducing sugar and protein. Number six, one molecule of X is formed by a single condensation reaction, releasing one molecule of water. What is molecule of X? A single condensation reaction, releasing one molecule of water, typically indicate the formation of this saccharide. And as this, it involves joining two monosaccharides together with the loss of one water molecule. And therefore, the correct answer for this question and the molecule X is a disaccharide. The table shows some information about carbohydrate polymer, which will describe collagen. Number seven, question for number seven is a similar question that come out in the exam paper for March 2022. And the description is indicate the answer for this question. The alpha 1 comma 4 glycosidic bond is the more common bond and it gave glycogen a helicon structure that is suitable for energy storage. And the alpha 1 comma 6 glycosidic bond are found about every 10 or so sugars and this great branching point. Therefore, glycogen is a very branch polysaccharide. So the answer will be A. Row B is, is the shape of the molecule is helicum and this is not glycogen. Row C is there is no alpha 1 common 4 bond and is a structural. So this is also not a glycogen. And row D 
is a helical shape, but do not have both types of bond and storage function. The diagram shows four phosphate molecule. Each molecule could contribute most to the fidelity of a cell structure membrane. The answer will be D. Number nine, which properties of phospholipid explain why a single layer of phospholipid added to water immediately formed by layers? The answer will be the hydrophobic fatty acid chain repel water molecule so the pairs pack together. And number two, the non-polar fatty acid chains are attracted to each other by hydrophobic interaction. So these two processes explain why phospholipid formed by layers when added to water. The hydrophobic tails avoid water while the hydrophilic heads interact with it. Number 10 is also a repeated question which is exists in examination paper for May 2023. So the diagram shows three examples of different bonds and which bond hold the category structures of protein together. The bond that hold the secondary structure of protein together are option bond one. And this bond formed between the element hydrogen and H and the carbonic oxygen of the peptide backbone. The answer should be bond one only. Which features of collagen enable it to fulfill a structural role in skin and in tendon? The correct answer is C. Collagen molecules are formed as a triple helix on polypeptide change. This is can be explained though when the collagen structure role in skin and tendon is due to its triple helix structure, where three polypeptide change are wound around each other. And this triple helix provides tensile strength and stability, which make collagen well suited for its structural function. Number 12. The graph shows how the concentration of four components 1, 2, 3, 4 of an enzyme catalyzed reaction change with the time. Which component is the enzyme substrate complex? For this, the answer will be 4. The table shows the Michel's intent constant Km for three enzymes. Which interpretation of the information is correct? Enzyme F has the greatest affinity for its substrate. Number 14, why explain how a signal molecule produced by one cell can be detected by a target cell? The correct answer given is a B, which is a signal molecule has a complementary shape to a cell surface receptor. Why? Because a signal molecule can be detected by the target cell because it fits like a key into a specific receptor on the cell surface. Number 15, some enzymes are produced in the cells of the pancreas. The enzymes are secreted when required. Which process is used to transport this enzyme out of the cells of the pancreas? The answer for these questions will be exocytosis. This can be explained when the enzymes are transported out of the pancreas cells through exo exocytosis where vesicle containing the enzyme fuse with the cell membrane and release the content outside the cells. Plant cell was submerged in a solution with a water potential less negative than that found inside the cells. What describe the condition of the plant cell after 20 minutes? The correct answer is the git. Why the git? Since the solution has a less negative water potential, higher water potential than the inside of the plant cell, water will move into the cell, making them the gate. And what will be present in each chromosome at the end of the G2 phase of the cell cycle? The correct answer is two molecules of DNA. This can be explained through the, the below, when at the end of the G2 process, or phase, each chromosome consists of two identical DNA molecules, which is called as a sister chromatid and due to DNA replication in the S phase, which event listed apart on the cell cycle. Interphase, metaphase, and 
cytokinesis are all part of the cell cycle. Interphase is when the cell prepare for division. Metaphase is a stage of mitosis. And cytokinesis is when the cell divide into two. The answer will be one, two, and three. Which features of embolism are affected by a drug that kills cells that are dividing mitotically? It's either cell repair, cell replacement, number of stem cells, tissue repair, tumor formation, is all correct answer. This can be explained through a drug that kills cell dividing mitotically could affect all these processes. It's either cell repair, cell replacement, number of stem cells, tissue repair, and finally, tumor formation. And 20, the graph show how the distance between sister promethate, which is curve P, and the distance between promethate and centrolus curve Q, changes during part of mitosis. Which statement could be correct? The correct is T to W, represent the mental phase, and W to X, represent anatomies. So, the correct answer is 2 and 3. Which statement helps to explain why the two sugar phosphate change in the DNA molecule are a constant distance apart? The answer is C, each purine base is linked to a pyrimidine base. This can be explained by a purine larger always paired with a pyrimidine smaller, keeping the distance between the two sugar phosphate change constant. 22. During the DNA replication, what must happen before a newly added nucleotide is bonded to the next nucleotide in the strain? The answer given is complementary base pairing and phosphodiester bond formation. This can be explained below when before a newly added nucleotide is bonded to the next nucleotide in the DNA strand during replication, complementary base pairing must occur. Ensure the correct base is added. Then, a phosphodiester bond formed between the sugar of the new nucleotide and the phosphate group of the previous nucleotide connect them in the DNA change. An antibiotic enters bacteria cells through a membrane channel protein P. Some bacteria cells have shown resistance to this antibiotic by acquiring the mutation which alters P. This mutation prevents the entry of the antibiotic into the cells. Which conclusion can be drawn about how resistance to this antibiotic develop in this bacteria? The answer will be the mutation resulted in the production of P with an altered territory structure. 24. What is the correct PRNA anticondor coding for the amino acid codon? The answer will be the correct PRNA anticondor coding for the amino acid codon is GGB. 25. The table shows the observation made by a student about three different cells like PQ and R seen in a transverse section of a plant stem using a light microscope. What type of cells are P, Q, and R? P is a xylem vessel element, which is the structure observed in the cell content 9. And Q is a polyan sieve tube element, where it's regular patterns of circles in the some cells in terms of the structure observed in the, in the cell content. And the R is actually the companion cells, which is represent granular appearance of the all cells. 26. Water molecules are attracted to each other. This property is important in the up upward movement of water in xylem. Which term is used to describe the attraction of water molecules to each other? The term used to describe the attraction of water molecules to each other is called cohesion. 27. The diagram show a model to demonstrate mass flow. In the plan, what are the structures W, X, Y, and Z, and what is the direction of flow of solution along W? The answer will be polyam, 
xylem is an X. Z is a root. Z or Z is a root. Leaf is a Y. And the direction of flow along W is from Y to Z. The part of the heart that control heart action are listed. Which row is correct for arterial contraction and then to put the contraction. The arterial contraction will be some producers wave of excitation. For the ventricular contractions, is quickly tissue carries wave of excitation. In B9, the diagram should part of the circulatory system in the mama, where is the blood pressure and the speed of flow the lowest. So the answer will be lowest blood pressure at the number four, and the lowest speed of flow is at the number one. The, the photomicrograph shows human blood cells. What type of blood cells is an X? X is phagocytes. The diagram shows some of the reactions of carbon dioxide when it enters the blood from cells in a metabolically active tissue, which a reaction is catalyzed by the enzyme carbonic hydrogen. The answer will be C. The graph shows the oxygen de association curve for hemoglobin in animals that live at high altitude and animals that live at low altitude. And what explains the oxygen de association curve at the high altitude? Hemoglobin has a higher affinity for oxygen. The diagram shows three features found in the mammalian gas exchange system which a structure of a gas action could be represented by X in the diagram. The features found in the mammalian gas action systems are ciliated epithelium and goblet cells. The structure represented by the X could be a small bronchitis. 34. What are short-term effects of nicotine on the cardiovascular system? The short-term effect of nicotine in the cardiovascular system include constriction of the small arteries, increase in the heart rate, and also increase in the blood pressure. So the correct options for these questions is one to three. Some features of a disease are listed. It can be transmitted by animal to other animals into the humans. And one mode of transmission is by transfusion with contaminated blood. The causative organism can show multiple drug resistance. And the majority of humans will die from the disease on children. And which disease has all these switches? The disease that has all these switches is referred to HIV slash AIDS. The following advice was given to a person traveling to a country where they might be an outbreak of an infection disease. Cook food well and eat it hot. Eat fruits and vegetables. Drink only cool boiled water. Wash hands often with the soap and cool boiled water. Which infection disease would this advance not to protect against? Thirty-seven. Which description of multiple drug resistant in bacteria is correct? The correct description of multiple drug resistance in bacteria is bacteria have DNA with the resistance gene for several different types of antibiotic. And which description of the P lymphocyte is correct? The correct description of P lymphocytes is they can leave the blood and accumulate at sites of inflammation. inflammation. 39. Where are antibodies found in an immune response? The correct would be B. On the surface of memory cells, antibody can be found, and the antibodies cannot be found in blood plasma. Monoclonal antibodies are used in the diagnosis and treatment of disease. They are produced using a technique known as cell fusion. And which two structures are fused together in this technique? The answer is a cancer cells and plasma cells.
With that being said, that's all for today's presentation. As an overall, as a conclusion, by by leveraging past examination papers, you can enhance your understanding, improve your exam technique, and ultimately achieve better results. So thank you very much for your attention and best of luck in your studies.